Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Psychonauts. Uh, apparently the game didn't save my progress last time, so I collected a handful of figments that uh, I thought I collected last time. It looks like I missed that one, probably because it was all the way out here in the middle of nowhere. This whole area is just kind of crazy here because I, I feel like I shouldn't be here, basically, down there in the, uh, in the water. But, whatever. We made it over here. So I'm kind of unsure of where I need to go. Um, well, oh wait, no, I remember. They mentioned three different areas you guys did. We go there, I think, there, or no, 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 it's there, there, and there. So, I don't know, I guess let's go into this one first. Yeah, it looks like that'll work. All right, so jump over here. Mm-hmm. My question is, how do I actually get on one of those without dying? Mm. I feel like I need to be on this thing, right? This uh, tightrope over here. I probably need to be on that and then use it to jump onto those things. <coughs> yeah, that's what it looks like. All right, get me up here. Luckily, Raz can touch water from the side and not worry about dying. I think I smell some ripe evidence nearby. Better investigate. Okay, so we need our projection. Oops, I forgot you actually have to hold it down until you finish drawing. Go get him, Doodle Bob. Sure, sure. Just take it easy, guy. Thank you, Doodle Bob. That's all I can think of. It's just that episode of SpongeBob. Oh god. Okay, what's with the weird paper airplane? Oh, that's evidence. I thought that was a figment. Uh, where are you? Hey, no, that's not right. Okay, trying not to die here. You're very annoying. You know that, you weird flying. Thing. Paper airplane. Gotcha. No, wait, I pressed Y. What? I pressed Y, damn you. Why? Hey, oh. <laughs> wait, what? Not now I'm working. What do you, wait, so I press Y on that and... Oh, is that not a figment? Is that... Is that... Yeah, that's you. That's why you were flying around me. I thought that was like the evidence or figment that I needed or something. Okay, that was weird. <clears throat> okay, yeah, that was weird. It's kind of transparent like a figment was, so... Here I was thinking it was a figment. Okay, the hatbox tag. I want this fishy, man. I'm gonna die in water so much trying to get all these stupid figments. Alright. Gimme. What is this supposed to be? Just a building? I guess so. Come here, fish. I need you in my life. Damn. Alright. I think that's all of them, though. Here. Alright, can I get in? I can. Oh. Okay. Uh, yeah, I should have expected this mechanic to come back for this. Uh, get me up there, please. And there we go, there's a figment. Yeah, this level's kind of nuts. I got a lot of stuff going on in this level, and it's super big. <laughs> I didn't expect it to be this big. Aha, uh -huh, there's the evidence that I need. Is that door a pigment? Yep. I feel like it might be. It might. Yeah, weird. That's probably just the exit. An easy exit to get out of here. Mm hmm. Can I wall jump off of this? Yeah, there we go. Now this looks fishy. Better take it as evidence. Uh, this looks incriminating, right? Oh, I thought it would actually tell me something. 
I think that's the best evidence I'll find in this part of town. I should check out the other neighborhoods for more. I'll take this again. Well, rank 38, I mean 78. We're getting up there in rank. Ew, why does it sound squelchy? I don't enjoy that it sounds squelchy. Ew, what is it covered in? It Oh, it's like ink coming out of a, like, pin, I guess? Oh, Nasty. Down. Sorry. Meow. Didn't mean to. Promise. <laughs> mean it. Alright, so... boom. Oh, hey, there's the hat box. Uh, there we go. Uh, come here, you beautiful, beautiful figment, you. There we go. What's up, friend? <laughs> Cry no longer. I have saved you from a life of loneliness. What is this? Should I set these on fire? They look kind of like lanterns, don't they? Well, evidently that's not what it wants me to do, so. Ooh, what's back here? I'm just getting uh, distracted by like everything here. Uh huh. Was there a point? I don't know if there was. Huh. Weird. Alright, have I already. I don't think I've already been back there, have I? I don't know. Well, let's just climb. Maybe I'll activate something later that'll. do something back there. Hey, you. Come here. Oh no, it's the Venus Flybook. There we go. Yay! I love the book aesthetic of this place and how all the houses and everything are made of books. It's pretty great. Uh, oh. Yeah, okay. Well then. Thank you. Huh? Ah, uh, seriously? Oh. And then I let off too early. Okay. Take me hand. Alright. I missed that AB, and I was kind of concerned about that. When maybe I shouldn't have been. Ah, come on! That one's such a pain to get. Screw that thing. I don't like that thing. Catfish and shoes to cure flat feet? What is this? Oh, you guys are so annoying. Ooh. Okay, setting them on fire is good. Because then they kind of run around and they can't dodge your attacks. Okay, that's very good, actually. Bang, bang. Bang, bang, bang. God, they're so annoying. <laughs> bang, bang. Luckily, sensors go down easily. This clean. For a fish market, I mean. But just dirty enough to have some juicy evidence, I'll bet. Come get your carp. Stanky fish! I don't need carp. Carp is garbage fish. Carp is garbage fish. Don't need trout. Or you'll get gout. Carp, carp, black carp, grass carp. That's a lot of carp. Fishy, fishy, fishy. All right, and that would take us out of here. So I probably need to talk to one of you, right? Music. I'll have some catfish, please. One catfish ish coming up. Catfish ish? It's so close to catfish, you can't taste the difference. Never mind. Say old catfish is even better for you. All right. Sorry, but. Why would anybody want to buy rotten fish? Listen, all the fish in this market is rotten. I'm the only one telling you the truth. Fair enough. Yeah? Hey, what's a panda bear doing in a fish market? Buying fish just like everybody else. Duh. Okay, I won't question it. Hi, I'd like some carp. Don't have any. What's that on your back? Plastic samples. I'm just doing test marketing. Tell me, how likely are you to buy carp in the next 10 days? 
Oh god, I, I, I used to take a lot of surveys when I was younger to get, like, Amazon cards and stuff. Or, like, GameStop gift cards. God, seeing not likely at all, somewhat likely, very likely, and extremely likely just brings back so many memories. Not good ones. Not likely at all. Thank you for taking our survey. You've automatically been added to our mailing no. list. No! Oh, great. Okay. Raz, you gotta block that. Time to gather evidence. You gotta block that email, Raz. That's the worst. Alright. Now that we're on a stupid mailing list for something we don't even want, let's go grab this garbage. Yeah, that one figment is so, so jerkishly placed. But, if I miss a figment like that that's in a really annoying spot, I'm not gonna get too bent out of shape about it, because... I mean, I haven't gotten all the figments in other levels, so... Oh, that one was optional. Well, it, when it's easy, I'll get it. Like, if it just requires some backtracking and stuff, I want it, obviously, because it, uh... It, uh, helps me level up and everything, but, like... That one, I tried multiple times, and I just couldn't get it. I, like, kept falling into the current at the wrong time. There we are. I still think I'm gonna be a pretty damn high level by the end of this. The 100, level 102 that you need for, um, the final, uh... Isn't it the time slow effect? Or is it clairvoyance? The one that lets you... makes it so your abilities have no cooldown. Level 102 might be the highest level. Jump, jump, jump. Whee! Ow. Wait, what was that that flew across, across the top of the screen? Was that my XYZ figment going into my figment count? Might have been it. There we go. Aha! This looks like evidence... of... something. Wow, you're gonna make me walk all the way out of here? Why are you gonna do that to poor Rasputin, huh? It's not right, it isn't. Come on, slide. Cool. <clears throat> well, it seems like we might be almost done with this level, so... I wonder what the boss fight's gonna be like for this level. Cool book boss. Maybe we'll get to fight the knight. Just one more piece of evidence to find. That was, uh, arguing with Zidrag. Alright. Take me down. I just don't like that noise, man. It's- it's not a good time, that noise. Ugh. Alright. Ooh, flagpole. With that on it. Um... I would like to get some of these other figments that are hanging around on these other boats. Yeah, there's, see, there's some, like, way back there and stuff. I guess I can just wait for them to come around right here. Probably the best way to go about it. And there's still the figments that are hanging out in the ocean. Or I say ocean, but... The ink. There's that stupid figment over there taunting me. Oh, whoa, how do I get to that, uh, tag? And stuff. Did I miss my opportunity to get that? I guess I did. I was supposed to, like, kind of jump down from up there and get it. Huh. Okay, maybe we'll go back up there and grab that. Because I want to get those things. Yeah. Yeah, I think I was supposed to jump down from there to it? I'm not positive, though. Huh. Okay. Well, we're going back over there. That's for sure. Maybe I'll have another opportunity to get this stupid figment over here. Okay, that was a mistake. Okay. Uh, there we go. Didn't think I was gonna make that for a second. Yeah, you. Oh, I had to jump across over there, I see now. Alright, let's try again to get this very jerkish figment. This is attempt number three. Uh-huh. Still no. That felt perfect. You know what? Let's just do this. Ah, uh, but that's gonna push me away. Or whatever. Darn it. 
That thing is so annoying to actually grab. I guess that's why they put those, uh... Mental links right there. Because they knew this one was a- WHAT?! Damn it. I hate jumping on, uh, trapezes like that in platformers. I always judge it wrong. I'm like, oh, I got it, and then I jump over it. Over the pole, at least. That I'm meant to be grabbing. Nope, nope, Raz, Raz, get up the pencil. I did not tell you to get off. You live on this pencil. I think I might just jump from the trapeze into the- Wow, seriously? Okay, screw that thing. No, I'm done. <laughs> it's not worth it. It's one figment, but it's just bothering the absolute hell out of me. God. Why's it gotta be so jerkish, man? <laughs> Here's the steamer trunk tag. Okay, uh... And the other thing was down here, right? Yeah. There we go. Well, at least I can get these things without going nuts. Carp air freshener? Carp air freshener? Ew. No. Don't do that. Bad. Bad salesperson. Get me on the boat, please. Thank you. And float. And float. And... Float. Ah, uh, oh, you were so close, Raz. You were so close. Oh well. Uh, we think we're good. Yeah, we're good. What if Raz got on the boat instead of flail? What, Raz? You're scared of the water, so you can't even grab a ledge anymore. What's wrong with you, man? You're supposed to be a platformer protagonist. I'm just gonna go this way instead of trying to go against the flow. <laughs> Trying to go against the flow is working against me. I know, what a concept. Trying to do the incorrect thing... ...isn't working out. It's craziness. Uh... Okay, it wants me to go up here? How do I get over there? Because there's something on that weird island. I'd be curious about that. Me up here too, because there's some stuff up here. Yeah, there's there's like that weird island over there that has something on it. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go grab this figment. Thank you. That one is very well hidden. There's something in there. Uh is this where I'm supposed to go or is this optional? I feel like this is optional. I'm gonna go check out what this is first. The EFG. I mean, uh, this- this feels optional. The other thing feels required. Sorry. Or they both lead to the same place. Oh, did that not work? Ah, it's you! Look! Over there! Are you- oh, okay. There we go. Sorry, I was in your way. Thank you, friend. Oh, that was where I was supposed to go. That was to show me that I could get in, but a different way. Well, we've got most of the figments here. Whoa, I'm an airplane. Are you? Oh, you are an airplane, yeah. Yep. We've, we've been over this. I thought you were a figment flying around my head. Alrighty. Is this a gang? Is this a gang? <laughs> Can I join? Oh boy. There you go. Die. Become inflamed. Hey you, come here. God, these guys are annoying. Okay, I will set you on fire. No effect. Protected by that enabler. God, go away. Yeah, burn to death. Jerk. Hate those guys. <clears throat> oh, sorry, I didn't mean to set you on fire, friend. Another one? At least I'd- oh no, there's a panic attack and an enabler. 
Oh no, that's a bad move, not a panic attack. Panic attack's what I'm scared of. I can get rid of it. There we go. Dead. Alright, um, I need... Uh... Die, please. Alright, so we need, uh... Clairvoyance. Jeez. If I could just CD this thing, I could find out what's causing it. Okay. What is it? There it is. Ow. Looks like those guys just went out of print. Wait, that was what awful. Am I doing? Oh yeah, collecting evidence. Raz, you never speak again. So never speak your shitty pun again. That was awful. I guess that was a play on words more than a pun. Yes. Oh. The I didn't even realize I told you to go over here and open this, but. I, I mean, I meant to do that. In the middle of the boss fight. Or in the middle of the fight, yes. I was that efficient with my time. Alright, we get it, Raz Archetype. We get it. Can you chill? Uh, what is that? Is that a Mahjong piece? Or Shogi? I have noticed there's been a lot of, uh, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not sure what kind of symbolism it is, but it's some kind of Asian symbolism going on here. I can't read the characters super well, and I don't know the language, so I can't really tell, which is very, very sad for someone that has a, uh, a, um, what's it called, um, degree, a, uh, I double majored in Asian history. But I don't know what that, uh, what language this is. Or the symbolism that's going with it. Okay, I was trying to wall jump that whole time. This, the instruments that they're using sound like what I've heard Chinese music sound like. More so than Japanese music, but I might just be wrong. Could be a lot of things, honestly. There's a lot of countries in, uh, Asia. So, and a lot of countries are very, very influenced by China due to China's history of being very imperial. How do I get up there? Like what? Oh, I run across the top up there. Okay. So, there we are. Here we are. Boom. Now this looks incriminating. I think that's all the evidence Cassie needs. In one of my history classes, actually, uh, I had the pleasure of meeting this uh, girl from Myanmar, which was super awesome because I had only just learned due to my Asian history classes that Myanmar even existed because it's a super, super tiny country in Asia. I got Asia. all the evidence I need. Better bring it back to Cassie quick. But it was just super neat to, like, find out about this country and then immediately meet someone that was from there, you know? Just shows uh, how much, uh, how ignorant we are of so many different subjects that I didn't even know this country existed. And I mean, who knows how many other people I've met from Myanmar throughout my life? Hello. Nothing? Alright, well, I have the duffel bag tag now. So we can go get that. That was over there by that place. There's also still some figments hanging out in the water. I'm really surprised we didn't get a boat of some sort to collect some of those things in the water. Yep. Like, they're both sitting in the water, but... I don't know. Yeah, and there's that figment. Like, what? How? How do? Yeah, I li unless you jump off of that to get over there, like that ink pen, to get over there to that. I don't know how you're expected to get that. Otherwise. Oh well. I've gotten most of the figments here. <clears throat> I feel pretty good about my figment count. Thank you, tag duffel bag. And this didn't work, right? This is what I expected. We would get on this and we could kind of, you know, put our oarsman badge to use, but no. It kind of just sits there. Okay. 
Well, I guess we should just go ahead and get out of here then. Yeah, I think I've collected most stuff. So, what are we missing? From Cassie's collection. One half mind, one memory vault, and the steamer trunk. I don't remember where the half mind is. I don't remember seeing it. Which sucks, because I've usually been pretty damn good about getting those. But if it's here, I don't think it's in this place. I feel like I got everything here, for the most part. And there's nothing on that. I would say something was there, but that just appears to be a figment, and that's it. And I still don't know how to get to it. Yeah, it feels like even jumping off of that wouldn't work. <clears throat> Alright, let's just go. Back in here. That's all the evidence we could get. Think it's enough? Let me be the judge of that. Oh, hey, it's Snake Cop. Oh, yeah. This is some hot dirt right here. We'll be able to blackmail her with this for years. Blackmail? I thought you were going to arrest her. What? How is she going to make the money she needs to pay us from jail? But if she's not <laughs> locked up and she finds out I was the one who sent her up the river. Hey, don't worry. We'll, uh, protect you or something. Let's beat it. This is why you don't trust we're cops. Bust. What? What? You said the thing. Ew. Not a chapter of which I am particularly proud. Hey, she was forced into the outlaw life. Not that part. I just meant... Nobody likes a snitch. There you are, all safe and sound again. Thank you, young man. You were a little loud for my liking, but you got the job done. And now you'll help me with those bees? Oh, are you scared of bees? Well, I know of one place where you'll feel completely safe. Hey! Put me down! Of all the double crossing! You could just squeeze this out of there. All part of the plan. <laughs> it was? Yep. And I thought I was the tricky one. Oh my, we've come to a bad place. No. It's perfect. How is it perfect? Any place is perfect. When we're all together. Well, I haven't seen you in a while. We should never have let her split us up. When we're together, nothing is impossible. Well, that tears it. I hate to damage a book, of course. But that last line was too corny. Even for a motivational speaker. We're not going to let you control us anymore. Oh, and which one of you thinks you should be in charge? None of you could stop Maligula. None of you could protect your friends. I am the real Cassiopeia. And I'll show you how we fight off a foreign invader. Ready for the shushing of your life! We have a librarian. <laughs> okay, sorry. Also, uh, yeah, so Cassie, Cassie in that particular outfit definitely. So, so she's Asian, but I'm not sure. She's like Chinese, Japanese, what? Like I said, I should really, I should really have a better idea, given my. Uh, history background, but I don't. If it was- a, a lot of my background is kind of scattered, like if you asked me to say what kind of uh, theater this was, Chinese or Japanese theater, I'd be able to tell you, but... Uh, clothes? We never really went over that much. Um... What am I doing here? I wanted to switch to... you. You probably, right? No, I still want this on because I want to catch you on fire. Everything. 
Ow. Okay, so those things really hurt. Wow, that actually really hurts you. Doing it. Uh, so we need to summon you, right? Ah, don't say I never gave you nothing. My dogs are barking today. There we go. That's my cue. Let me in there. I'll see if I can write a better ending to this story. I think she's Japanese. What's going on? Who's in here? Hello, Cassie. You? A self-righteous little writer? What are you doing in here? We writers are most effective when we get inside someone's head. Ah! Okay. Uh, okay. Okay, you. Give me your honest opinion on how I'm doing so far. Go away. And... Ow. And slap. Once you've uh -huh. read my book, there is nothing you can't accomplish! Die! That was a cold war! Awesome. You shall pay for it! Uh, okay. Oh, am I supposed to... I've been using my uh, the other stuff this entire time. Am I supposed to throw this at you? I am. why we shouldn't let kids in the library. Okay. I will silence I'm just going to take a quick break. Make some tea. Get the other aspect in there. My turn, Raz. Get that gate open so I can teach her a lesson. Yes, I will do this. You need this more than me. Get in there. Give me this HP. Thank you. Yeah. I'm not asleep, you're asleep. When my students fall asleep in class, they get sent to the principal's office. Oh no, not you. That's right, now it's two on one. Hey, don't forget to count me. Yeah, I'm doing a lot of the fighting here. My aspect just gave department. me HP. Oh, there you are! Mr. Enemy Man! <laughs> Mr. Enemy Man! <laughs> that was funny. Ow. Jerk. Die. Okay, he's dead. Where's the pin? Are you dropping me a pin? Thank you. Or that. That works too. Um. Kablooey! We got him on the. on the run. Get that gate open, kid, and I'll bust this whole crooked operation. Uh. Oh, it's recharging. Okay. There you go. Get in there. Time for the money maker. Oh no. No, no, no. Something's not right. In fact, you could say something stinks. You! Oh no. I can't handle all three of you at once. That's kind of the point. Ready, gals? I'm ready. Together now! Ah! Oh no, her head exploded. Or was trapped in a book. It just looked like a, a stump for a second there. Which was pretty unsettling. Rest in peace. Hi, Cat. 
can't believe I failed. Again! I guess, I guess I'm... not the real Cassie. Yes, you are. And so am I. Me too! Mostly when we need money. Hey, I'm pretty good in a fight. You might have noticed. Oh, what a nice message about accepting all parts of yourself. Hi. Uh, are you the real Cassie? Hmm, not sure. But I'm sure she's in here somewhere. Now then, did you say something about my bees? Yes, I need them swept away. If you would so kindly. Oh my, they really aren't behaving, are they? That's it. I'm all out of bee puns, I promise. Think you can do something about them? I'll try, but I feel like I've lost a little control of them. Oh, how I wish my old partner were here. I think they just need a nap. Oh, bully! How did you know I needed you? A little bird told me. Oh, sorry, I should say three little bees. Well then, think we can get this swarm to stand down? I do. Bedtime for bees. Bee mancers. So, how's production? Eh, jars of honey and no one to give it to. Come on! There we go. Prepare. Who knows what you will find inside Nono's mind. Be sure you are ready before activating the astrolathe. Yeah, uh, that might be the end of the game warning there. But I can't get back to the other things um, that we haven't done yet, unfortunately. But uh, let's go ahead and get that upgrade. And what else do we have to do here? Yeah, missing a memory vault, a half mind, and an emotional baggage. I know there was one of the doors that I needed projection um, to get into. So we can't go in here now. Is it time to take a spin in the brain tumbler? Damn right yes. it is. I'm ready to go to the collective unconscious. We also have a uh, Hollis's mind that we need to go into as well. So there's that too. But uh let's see here. Uh oh, I got to actually equip astral projection, huh? That would or mental projection, that would probably help. Astral projection. This is Hollis, right? Yeah. Okay, so hot streak is where I've got to go. And yeah, there's something I'm missing in here. I think there might actually be two of the weird doors in here. Hmm. Hey, Hello. little buddy. I need to get somewhere quick. Uh, was it cardiology? Yeah, th there's one here. I don't remember if there was two in here, but I know there's at least one. Got a little bubble juice in my nose that time. It's right over here, isn't it? Yes. Oh, that's the nugget. Okay. Whoops. Spawned you on a spot you couldn't stand. It's you to the door like a pesky bill. Here I go! Under the door like a pesky bill. I'll take this I could do without the sound effects. Paper Raz. Thank you. Alright, was that... Um, what else are we missing here? Uh, Hollis's hot streak. So, we're missing one more nugget of wisdom. And I have no idea where that is. It wasn't in here, I don't think. I think there's another weird door somewhere else that I haven't been to. Maybe. I have all the abilities now, so I should be able to get everything in here. It's just, uh, the act of actually finding it. 
So let's head back out here, I guess. We'll try another area. Could you give me a lift? So what about the maternity ward, maybe? Yeah. Let's give this a shot. Might be another door in here. I didn't have Thanks to list it in my notes, but eh, yeah, no, nah, there's nothing in here either. Okay, let me look around for a few seconds and see if I can find it. Aha, there it is. I see you. So, get me up there, please. Thank you. And then we can connect to there and there. And there it is. There's two figments left in here, but... Like I said, I don't know if I'm gonna get all the figments. If I do... It'll be something I do on my own time when I'm, like, kind of bored and just want something to do. I'll go back into each of the levels and, uh, Could you give me a lift? do that. So let's go back to the collective unconscious. So if I do this, it doesn't kick me out of the brain tumbler, right? Okay, so the, the reason I was going back out to the brain tumbler every time before was because I just clicked exit brain. So, what is this? This is Ford. So, I think I'll just do um, Cassiopeia's Mind because I know where the uh, weird door is in here, or I know there is one in here. And I know where a lot of the ones in the overworld are too. But this one especially. Alright, so... Yeah, there's nothing else here in the main room. So it's gotta be somewhere over here. This level was so big. May I trouble you for a bubble? Deep inside, teacher's domain... Waterfront, collective unconscious. Okay, so... Yeah, we need to do this again. One of a kind! I got this! I think it was in one of these rooms, wasn't it? On my back. No. What are you doing? Is that a penny over there? Sure, sure. You can take it what? easy, big what? guy. What? 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 Why, why are you doing this? How's it going? You need a bit flat. <laughs> Do it, man. Do this. There we go. Ooh, Never mind. Brain. Apparently, I have to do it, not him. Okay. So. <laughs> Was what I'm missing, what I was missing in here? Yeah, there it is. I see it. I was right, it wasn't here. Cool. In here, little dude. I think if I use projection on this door, my archetype would go in there. That's the half mind, good. Because that's the thing I wanted the most. <laughs> I said sup clone, and he said, Oh, that's cute. My clone thinks he's real. Funny. Alright. Go through there and go get that. Thank you kindly. Alright, so what else are we missing in here? Cassie's collection. We're missing a memory vault, which I would like to get. Those are important to me. Forget that. Cool, he's going. Okay, fine, you do that. Why not? Would not go in there if I. What are you doing? Are you stuck? There we go. Now get it. Go. Okay, yeah, you were stuck on the books over there. Weird. Thank you. Alright. Is what I needed in here? Like, the memory vault is important to me because you find out, you know, lore, basically. And I like that. There's a figment I was missing. Just hanging out over there. 
Okay, so this is evidently not where I needed to be. Alright, well, we got a figment out of the deal at least. We're only missing ten of them, surprisingly. Alright, well, I'll look around a bit until I see something of interest. That's what this thing does. I think it like lowers that. Interesting. It, and it, it lowers it and then it'll like raise back up. Okay, so we probably want to get up there and do that. Can I jump up here like that? No. Okay, let's get up to it from up here. And then I think I send my archetype to go pull the lever for me. Wow, that chair was making a ton of noise. Oh my god, that's so fast. Yeah, this is the where I wanted to use the time bubble stuff. Oh god, hiccup, please. Oh no. God, those things are so fast. They come out, and then they're like, we immediately go back in. Does my time slow cool down that fast? Doesn't feel like it should. Oh no, it, it does, I guess. Yep, it does. Uh-huh. Me over there. Yeah, okay. Time slow cools down basically immediately. Alright, so... Where's that thing? There it is. All right, little dude, go get that. Aha, so this is how we get these figments. So we did need this dude. Cool, all right. Well, I'm glad I figured that out. Maybe there's even something important up here. Uh, there is stuff. Hey, it's Ford. Wow, Ford, you look so young. Ah, yes. I was brilliant back in the day, but now I'm a little, um, all over the place. But I'm sure if Cassie keeps attending her beehives, I'll come back to my old self someday. Is that all that's up here, really? Just you guys? I mean, this is neat, don't get me wrong, but I expected there to be something really important up here. Agent Bull? Hello, little boy. Can you help me get into the literature wing? I wish I could, but the way through is blocked. In a most confusing manner. I, I do get so overwhelmed without Cassie here to help me. She's so good at multitasking, you know. She's my best friend. Why isn't she helping you? I don't know. Where is she? No. Hey, Mentalis. Hey, Otto. What you thinking about? Oh, nothing. I just post like this so people think I'm smart and thinking all the time. I'm a little fool of myself. <laughs> oh, <laughs> So this is what Cassie thinks of you guys. So she said Ford's all over the place. Compton, you know, needs her around. Otto's full of himself about Helmet. Oh, I'm an airplane. Hi, Helmet. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, and Helmet just likes sprays. Excuse me. Bob Zanotto? Uh, what? Excuse me? Oh, uh, hello. What are you doing up here? Not sure. Probably something to do with plants, I'll bet. I was always really into that kind of stuff. Okay, that's funny. So it's like her impression of everyone. Lucretia? Lucretia Mux? Please call me Lucy. Hi. I don't want to make things awkward, but you kind of murdered my grandma. Well, I don't know who your grandma is, kid, but uh, I don't doubt it. I murdered a lot of people. Why did you murder all those people? I don't really know. I was the nicest person during my time at Green Needle Gulch. 
What were you doing at Green Needle Gulch? Otto Montales recruited me to use my powers for hydraulic titanium mining. Which kiss he told us was very bad for the environment, but nobody listened to her as usual. Don't you also go by another name? Oh, what? Colloquio Max Malicula, Grolovia Spain, Vet Vanda. That last Wet one Wanda. is a stage name for an act that was banned in three countries. Oh no. I don't want to hear about that. <laughs> Raz's face. He's like, please no. Did you used to be friends with Cassie? Cassie tried to be friends with me, but I was too busy making Google eyes at Fort Crawler. I ruined everything, you know. No. Oh. So before you became Maligula, you were a nice, normal person? People are complicated, kid. Ah, you're too young to get it. I'm gonna go. Try not to kill anybody. <laughs> okay, I'll try. <laughs> no promises. Bye, Nona. <laughs> What's that sound? Uh, my not Nona. Oh, hey, there you are. So there was something important up here besides that vomit Cassie's of war we just got. Package is all sorted. Maybe now she can write another book. Uh, gimme. And that one I can just grab. Cool. So that's we're missing four figments now, and yeah, where is that other memory vault at? That's the only thing I'm really kind of stumped on. Oh, I just got one of the figments I missed. I still don't know how to get up there, but part of me feels like that's where the memory vault is. I feel like I explored most other places, so I'm gonna try to get over there and everything. All right, here we are. Let's see if we can make this jump. If it's even possible. I don't think that's possible. How are you supposed to get over there? I do not know. Huh. Yeah, I'm stumped about that. Ah! Yeah, beats me how to get over there, man. <laughs> I've tried most of what I could think of, and uh, I just don't see it. And I also don't know where this last bit of uh, other stuff is. The, um, God, what's the word I'm looking for? Jeez. This is messing me up so much now that I can't even, like, speak. Uh, the, the memories. Jeez, the memory vault. Yeah. Hmm. It's just bothering me because I, I see, like, no way to do it. And then I think about this and I'm like, what was the point of this place? Which also bothers me. But I, I don't know, man. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and exit. I think we're good. I got most of the stuff in there. It sucks that I didn't get the vault, but I don't know. All right, but that is a hour long episode of Psychonauts 2. So, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. Actually, Thanks for that special projection in your life. Oh, I can make another challenge marker too. Um, you can actually make like three. Let's combine that sideboard with your card so you can rank up. Wow. Okay. Wait, I only. Oh, it's nine, not eight cards. Whoops. Yeah. My bad. Alright, and here. Digitize your archetype. Oh, that's awesome. Muffles your archetype to give your ears a rest. That's kind of nice. Watch your archetype move like the wind. Your archetype explodes into confetti upon death, damaging nearby enemies. That's pretty good. I mean, I can afford a few of these things. Let your time bubble to slow a much bigger area. Speed up objects and enemies rather than slowing them. More time out of your time bubbles. Oh, that's the hot stuff right there. And we'll just get those two since they're the most expensive. Dianara, psychic. There we go. I leveled up some more. So... Did I get anything interesting out of that? 
Or a radial shockwave to my ground pound. I think I'll take that. All right. And with that, we'll go ahead and end this episode off here. So I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.